Number four, which ordered pair is in the solution set of the following system of inequalities? Okay, we can graph that by hand and do all the shading. I want to show you how to use the calculator. So I don't know what and who had this calculator last, so I'm going to press home because I want to clear everything out. Um, and the reason I say that, let me go back real quick. You see all these windows open up here? I want to close all that down because I'm using it now and I want to start fresh. So home and you are going to go to new document. I notice the screen is dark y'all. Maybe if I zoom in and make it better or if I move it over. New document and then no we do not want to save it and then now we want uh, a graph. Okay, so you can see it now. It was just at the beginning. Okay, watch your eyes. I'm going to focus. Watch your eyes. Look away. Look away. Okay, you can look again. Let's first delete the equal sign. Press the delete button. And then this box pops up. So we want less than, which is number two. Press enter when you get that. It changes it to Y. Okay. Now we are going to plug in one half. If you use this, which is by the nine, put the one and the two. But now you have to press the over button. If you don't, this is what happens. So you don't want that to happen. Delete that X. Press over, and this little bitty line becomes big. Now do X plus four. I'm going to press the down arrow instead of pressing enter because I don't want to press tab. So press down. It gives you another spot to put in another equation versus having to press tab. Delete that. And now let's do greater than or equal to. So greater than or equal to. Now negative x plus 1. Use the negative under the 3 by the decimal. Do not use the, it looks like negative but it's a minus sign under uh, the division sign or by the plus sign. So used by the three. Negative x plus one, enter. This is solid, this is dashed. There is my solution set, my solution area, the double shaded region. <coughs> Excuse me. So which one? would be in this shaded region. Negative 5, 3. So 1, 2, oh, negative 5. That's positive 5. Go the other way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Positive 3. 1, 2, 3. Well, we can stop. We know we're going opposite of that direction. So 3, negative 5. 1, 2, 3, negative 5. Go down. Ah, nope. 0, Four. Now, for those that are getting confused, write your x and your y. Um, the x is zero, so go to y four on the y. One, two, three, four. That is on. Let me move up a little bit because you can't. My pencil was off a little bit. Right there. It is on a dashed line. So, nope. That leaves one answer, but let's check. And for those that get lost on that. The y is zero, so that means we're talking about x, the four on the x. So one, two, three, four. Bum, bada bing, bada boom. There it is. There it is to be exact. Yes, and it's in the shaded region. The answer is D. And guess what? I'm done with this video.